Hey guys, Patrick 979 here. I'm gonna bring to you today a first look video on uh, the newest thing I got. Uh, this is a power bank, a USB power bank uh, from Oki. I'm gonna show you the model number and the little card here. So this is the new release Lightning. Uh, you know, just some details if you guys want to see some serial number here. So, but the uh, number of the power bank itself is PBN36. So it's a Two, uh, 20,000 uh, milliamp hour batteries uh, charger, so uh, power bank, so uh, with IQ technology, so uh, it can charge pretty much everything. It knows the right voltage, uh, supposedly. So um, perfect for ha perfect hand filling, stable, safety uh, and safe lithium polymer batteries. So let's take a look at the unit and what comes with it. So you get. Uh, the the, the um, power bank and any OK products come with a 24 months warranty but it's actually 18 months and you have to register uh, online to get the extra six months warranty so you just have to fill that out I don't know if you gotta send that out but uh, or you can register it online so anyways uh, it comes with that it comes with an instruction manual uh, a couple of things in here so uh, it gives you I'm gonna show you guys that so what's fun about this is if you look here there's a lightning input so in micro USB input but the charge rate for recharging this is like four times better than my all power I think the whole power is uh, input is at um, 500 milliamp hour and this is at 2 amp hour so uh, a lot faster for recharging so they say in here that uh, was it there uh, da, 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 da. Uh, somewhere it says that it can recharge uh, in like something like um, there you go here so here it says uh, you can be recharged in 10 hours so that is a game changer I mean I don't know if Oki is the one that came out with this first or you know but there this is one of the first one I saw now that there's a couple of companies catching up like Rav Power but I really like the features of that so and the form factor is pretty nice too as you guys can see in the back, OK power bank, 20,000 milliamp hour. Uh, you got your details here, air it show, and all that stuff. So let's look at the power bank itself. So pretty nice and sleek, black design. So this is the latest version of the power bank. So 20,000 milliamp hour. You got a, a flashlight. You can see here that says it's charged. Uh, with that, if you leave your button, uh, your finger press on there, you activate the flashlight. So nice little flashlight in the dark. So this is like, uh, you know, something small that you could light your pad if you're uh, outside and you don't have any flashlight. So you just press again, hold, and it's gonna turn off. Uh, one thing I wish they could have done with this, instead of putting just a little LED there, is put the uh, an actual nice emitter, uh, something like a uh, XPL or something, uh, just a, a little bit better flashlight. You get a massive 20,000 uh, milliamp power power bank. Uh, you could add a little bit more power for the flashlight and make it a little bit more useful. So, but anyways, let's look at the ports. So you get two ports with IQ charging. So uh, I'll put one. I'll put two here. So you could put plug in anything and it'll detect automatically iPad, iPhone, uh, any uh, Android device that you want to put in. But where's the difference is here is that you get a lightning connector. Uh, right here and a micro USB connector so which is fun is if you are a iPhone person you don't need to bring an extra cable so you could just use your charger from your iPhone or for your iPad or if you're an Android person you can just use your micro USB and this gives you versatility uh, which is really nice uh, so you don't have to bring an extra cable around uh, in the box too it comes with a uh, charging cable so for charging your device itself so it's a micro USB so um, you can use to uh, that to recharge it's pretty small but you know, it's always fun to have an extra micro USB charger so nice and thick too so but really small so you just plug it in there and but the least distance you have between your uh, your port and your device itself uh, the better the uh, the energy uh, transmission is gonna be, is gonna be so anyways um, let's see form factor wise compared to let's say in my all power so I got an all power here so let's put that out of the way so let's see with the all power 
so a little bit wider not much uh, if I put it on top here you can see it's almost um, let me turn it around here so it's almost the same thickness but it's smaller and this one is 16,000 milliamp hour and this one is 20,000 milliamp hour which I'm gonna have to test out of course I'm gonna do some testing I'm gonna take something that you know has got a lot of capacity uh, and I'm, uh, I'm gonna discharge and I'm gonna be using uh, where did I put that? Uh, there it is. So I'm gonna be using this thing here when I'm gonna be recharging it so uh, this uh, little uh, meter uh, you know USB charge meter is really practical so uh, if I want to test how much capacity it's gonna give me you know the charge rate the uh, voltage and the capacity that it's putting into something so really useful and I really like this thing so I'm gonna be able to do some testing to see how much actual um, actual uh, you know a voltage or volume that you can put in there so for charging so anyways guys I just wanted to get give you guys a first look video uh, you know, I bought some Oki stuff. I got plenty of Oki stuff uh, right here. Some charger, that, some cable. So just just to show you guys a couple things I got from Oki. So Oki, why do I, you know, choose Oki? Uh, the price is appealing, and the warranty, the 24 months warranty, is appealing. But another thing that made me go for this one is uh, the, the price that was pretty interesting uh, I think I paid twenty eight dollars no taxes in Canada no nothing because it's from Oki Direct but another thing that's interesting is their um, customer service so they, they, they're really out there to make sure you, the, the customers are happy and they you know you get great service from their from their uh, you know from, from their company so uh, one of the thing that's as important as the product itself that you're buying you know from from anything uh, even though I've been a little bit disappointed with their charger um, one thing that's uh, very important to me as much as the product itself is uh, how the company is going to treat you so uh, customer service to me is number one priority if I find a company that's out there thinking of their customers uh, you know always being helpful uh, to, to resolve some issues and they're there for the customer uh, this is gonna create brand loyalty and you're gonna get people coming back to buy more stuff from them example you know I got a couple things from Oki so <laughs> uh, anyways I really like their their uh, their product for some of this stuff there's some things I had some issues but like I said I'm using that to charge my phone I might not be able to use that with my X-Star charger or this doesn't have enough juice but it's still enough to charge a phone or a tablet or stuff like that so basically the thing it was meant to be charging and to be useful for uh, the X star that would have been just a bonus but my raft power seems to be doing the job for that I might have to get another one for my uh, other um, for my other X star charger because I got another one which I should do a review on because this is a great charger and uh, since I bought two it tells you how much I love it so Anyways, guys, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this um, this little uh, first look on this uh, new charger from Oki. So uh, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna post this video, and uh, you know, hopefully, I'm gonna be able to start doing some testing. I'm gonna make sure this thing is fully charged um, before I you know uncharge it and then plug it in and see the capacity and test it out. So I'm gonna do a couple of testing on that part. Another thing I want to mention is that this package has arrived through Amazon and Amazon I have a mailing box that's a commun community ma mailing box and it's outside in the cold and this thing has been sitting in the cold for about a few hours because I knew it was going to be delivered today but it's still sitting in the cold so I hope it didn't affect anything it was a few degrees below freezing uh, actually uh, a lot below freezing so uh, hopefully it didn't impair the charger itself it's been there for a few hours so it might not be so bad uh, other than that but I wish Amazon had an options uh, especially since for me this is something that's sensitive some other stuff that I order from Amazon you know tools and stuff like that I don't care but I wish they had an option on Amazon that you could just click and you know you had to sign for the package so it had to be hand delivered or delivered to your local uh, postal uh, office so you could go sign for it and you know it's not outside in the cold and just it, it, this is not not as good for the electronics I'm thinking so 
anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give it a thumbs up look forward to the review in the future and I see you guys on the next one